everybody. Long time no see again. Um, basically, I'm in the French countryside. I'm in the forest right now. Uh, basically, my morning, I woke up at 7 a.m. because I was FaceTiming some of my friends back home. Um, you, you would have already seen what I did this morning, but I'm just going to recap it anyways. So I did a little FaceTime with them, and then I did some yoga this morning. Um, just kind of woke myself up slowly and steadily. Um, I did go back to bed though after 7 a.m. because I stayed up too late last night as per usual and was exhausted. Um, I just had a little breakfast, had a coffee, and I'm just on a walk around the grounds. Um, yeah, it's been a really chill morning. It's been a, it's Sunday today and it's going to be like 20 degrees out right now. It's so nice. So I thought it was the perfect day to film a little welcome to my quarantine life <laughs> in a French chateau in the countryside. Um, I was really dumb and underestimated how long I was going to be here. So I didn't bring any of my cords for my camera or for my computer. I didn't bring my vlog camera. I just I was being dumb. So I didn't bring any of my tech stuff, so which would have allowed me to edit old videos. So I thought, you know what, my iPhone 11 Pro, whatever it is, is good enough quality. So I'm just going to film. Oh my god, some sticks just fell in that tree and scared the shit out of me. Anyways, um, so I thought I would just film a little welcome to my quarantine life because I think... The nature here is very calming to look at and just very peaceful and nice. So yeah, technically I'm still kind of supposed to be working, but I think it's a very unique situation being quarantined here. So yeah, um, in the meantime, since I can't put out any of my previously filmed videos from this year, um, I just thought I would film this and give you guys something to hang on to while I get my video life together and pump some videos out so i've been doing things like stretching yoga i've been reading a lot i've been writing a lot journaling a lot um i restarted my blog so i've been exploring all the nature here and it's been really amazing and i'm really happy to not be trapped in my box in paris as much as i miss paris um lots of my friends have gone home well i think pretty much all of them, so it's not like I would be having a good time there, at least here. I'm, I'm out in the open, and it's beautiful scenery in the Normandy region of France. So I think something that's really important to keep in mind during this time, even though I did say I've been doing all those productive things, um, I think it's really important to rest and feel rested and... I've been sleeping a lot, like, more than I ever have in my life, um, because I'm kind of an insomniac, but I think this is such a stressful time for everybody that you really just need to listen to your body and take a second each day to breathe and calm down and call your family, call your friends, um, especially for me, I've been finding that I've really had to take it easy on myself just so that I don't have a breakdown every single day. That being said, I hope you find my quarantine life, um interesting and maybe give you some ideas of some things that you want to get up to. I think we're going to have a picnic this afternoon for lunch so that will be really nice because it's a beautiful day out. Um, I'm going to show you guys my outfit. Okay so this light is bad but um, my black top is Brandy Melville. My leggings are Outdoor Voices. My shoes are Nike. My, they're actually my run, like cross country running runners, but you know, don't have a ton of clothes here, so I'm making it work. And then this flannel, it's really extra try on haul. Um, this flannel is from Aritzia, it's the brand TNA. These, this is like half the clothes that I brought here basically, so the outfits are not very varied because I wear the same thing every day. <laughs> So for someone who is very hyperactive and always has to have a plan and a schedule and keep herself busy, this time has been like really scary and weird. It's nice to have my alone time. It's nice to be with the family. Um, yeah, it's, it's 
definitely it could be a lot worse. So I'm very thankful that they invited me out here. Um, yeah. Okay, so from the outside of the back of the house, my room are these two windows right there. Um, so yeah. Picnic time. I have to get everything out and like do a photo. Yes. spent the majority of my afternoon just in the backyard over that way out my window um just having a picnic with the girls and chatting um so it was really nice it's so hot out it's like 22 degrees i can't even believe it um i've never experienced 22 degrees in april in my entire life hashtag canadian so i just thought i would show you guys a little something that I have been doing during this quarantine to keep me organized and feeling like I have something to accomplish every day. So basically, I'm a person who always needs my agenda, but since I couldn't bring a lot of stuff here, I didn't bring it. So I made a little like makeshift one on Google Docs. It just says little makeshift agenda to keep me sane without mine. Maybe I'm just like a really weird OCD freak person, but this is what I've been doing each day to kind of like just give me a time like just things like little accomplishments I don't know about you but I always feel so good when I can like check off a box and just it's been keeping me productive and helping me stay on top of my university work and helping me feel like the days have a purpose and that they're not just all blending into one day one like continuous loop so it can even be so something as simple like reading or finished movie like it's not complicated stuff I mean this is my weekend so like if we look for what I have planned for tomorrow and Tuesday it's a bit more intense like work on Harvard video submission Rutherford scholarship blah 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 all this stuff um but even something like a shower like <laughs> it's just it's nice to check things off a list even if it's something so simple as like laundry or whatever eating a lint chocolate and these things remind me so much of my mom they're her favorite I, mean, even, like, I can't believe we dumb. found the Dickies. Oh. I don't know. That's a good name. I actually like it. I think it's cool. <laughs> it's fashion, people. <laughs> it's really digging this this vibe. <laughs> Work. Where's your jacket? Ha ha ha. It's because it's camouflage. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> What's the guy's name from um, Grey's Anatomy? The hot doctor? Uh, I can't think of it. Patrick Dempsey. Oh yeah, Patrick. I'm holding it up with my neck. <laughs> <laughs> So, Philippine and I just went through this old, um, memoir, what's that in English? Wardrobe, um, filled with some clothes, since we obviously didn't bring a ton of clothes out here, staying for longer than we thought, so, yeah, do some vintage shopping in the chateau, and now I'm going to go help the, um, men with hauling some wood. And then I'm going to read and journal.
off for the night. Um, basically, we just watched a movie called Bienvenue chez les Ch'tis, which is actually a movie that I had to watch in French class, class in um, school, which is kind of funny, but I'll insert the, the movie cover here. Um, so yeah, it was a really awesome Sunday. Um, normally, I have to do an hour of English with my house kid, um, Hillier, but since it was a weekend, I didn't have to do that. Um, and then also normally Kichi and I take one of the ponies, Alzaro, for a walk in the evenings. But since we were helping um, with the wood, we didn't have enough time. But I will insert some videos of the ponies because they're really cute and it's usually something that we do every day. Um, I hope you enjoyed my little quarantine life, um, just taking it day by day. I'm just going to do some journaling and some reading and then head to sleep. So I'll insert little clips of that, um, just like showing you how I, I do my journal. Um, so yeah, have a great day slash night slash afternoon, wherever you are in the world. And I love you so I'm back. Um, I hope that you're all healthy and safe during this quarantine weird COVID-19 it's really freaky um if you ever need anybody to talk to you about it feel free to DM me on Instagram at Avery the Alien um and I will be more than happy to have a chat so yeah